Someone had sent me a really good question, and it's one that I had when I first started out, involving the elemental tools and whether or not they should be constructed yourself, or could you go with just something that you're drawn to, or do you even need them at all? And they had specifically asked about the Golden Dawn ritual tools, the, uh, the elemental tools, the pinnacle, the air dagger, the water cup, and the fire wand. So let's address the last part of the question first. Do you even need the tools at all? I know I had said previously that one doesn't actually need the tools because they're symbolic. And yet, unless you're an adept, you're probably going to need the tools because they're symbolic and I will explain this further but do you need the Golden Dawn tools or can you just use something that you're just drawn to as a representation and that depends on whether or not you're using the Golden Dawn system if you are in fact using the Golden Dawn system then yes you should be using the tools the ritual tools the elemental tools of the Golden Dawn there are those in other systems that can effectively use a feather or an arrow to represent air instead of the air dagger. The question really isn't what tools are you drawn to. The question is what system are you drawn to? For it's the system that has the full and complete working set of symbolism within it. Not the tools. The tools are a part of that. So when you start mixing and matching different implements of different systems, you're mixing and matching the symbolism. And then you run the risk of not having a full and complete set of working symbolism and leaving things out. So yes, if you're going to use the Golden Dawn system, you should be using the Golden Dawn tools. And that would be the advice I would give for any system use the tools within the system that you're drawn to that you have chosen 